This is a weird idea that's kind of a semi-impromptu at-home party trick. It's pretty straightforward. Basically you take your last ice cube before you refill your ice cube tray and you stick it in there at an angle. Okay, and then when you refill it and then freeze it, and you'll notice it fell over there, that's fine. You can just pick it back up and reposition it. Okay, put a little bit more water in there if you need to. And I'll clean that up later. Then you put that back in your freezer. When that freezes, you'll have your uh, in. What do, I don't even know what you'd call it. It's not really a gimmick, but your uh, altered ice cubes ready to go. So now that the ice is frozen, you can see our pre-made altered ice cube, whatever you want to call it, is now frozen and ready to go. You just need to crack it out of there and you've got two ice cubes fused together. Now, in presentation, it's a fairly simple matter of holding this with that ice cube hidden. So that looks like a perfectly normal ice cube. So once you've made your gaffed or altered ice cube, you can either get yourself a drink and simply add it as one of your ice cubes, or you know, secretly hide it in your hand, pretend to take it out, or simply go grab a couple of ice cubes from the freezer. So then you hold your gaffed ice cubes, concealing the uh, the merged one there and your secondary ice cube and you bang them together and then simply allow that one to fall into the hand with one of the clunks and then reveal the fused nature of the ice cubes. Meanwhile you're holding out here and then perhaps uh, either toss this in your mouth or toss it into your back into your drink and then secretly adding in the concealed extra one because you know why not handle your ice cubes and make a mess it's the kind of thing to do at a party right <laughs> you can do it at home for friends or if you're hosting a little get together uh, I've also actually done it just casually at my, at the office if you've got an ice cube tray and a fridge and a freezer at the office and you're one of the only people who happens to refill the ice cube tray, you can easily set this up uh, when you're on the last few ice cubes, you know. Set it up, fill it up, and uh, just go back, you know, whatever, 20 minutes, however long it takes for uh, ice to freeze. You know what, I never actually uh, noticed because I always just go back a few hours later. But, you know, you can do this, like I said, even, uh, even at work. Uh, so, there you go. Why not? <laughs>